What up, guys? It's your girl, Meeks, and I am back with more The Brother's Son. If you're enjoying this reaction series and that's kind of my channel, go ahead and subscribe. I'm here. You're here. Let's be here together. Down below, switch by the link on Patreon. It's patreon.com forward slash Meeks. So that full link version of my reactions will get to clear and select access series. And also, for merch shop, teach that who's most all type things, written inside some scenes, support monetarily. Those subscribers can come to Patreon and get my merch shop. You just want to tell you, support me free, Taylor. How you may subscribe? Why? Biatch is free. It costs zero. I'll subscribe to button. Hit the location button before you know what to be notified of my videos and also the gaming channel which i am going through um we've got dredge we've got Baldur's Gate three and we've got final fantasy nine interested in any of that's gonna be on many mix gaming and listen i'm thoroughly enjoying this show it's so much fun it's so much fun but i know charles is about to have his hands full trying to protect his brother and tell him what's going on in the family and essentially i think his mom still wants to keep bruce out of it I think it's gonna be hard but ma'am that's not my business not my circus not my monkeys it's their monkeys and their circus so i'm just gonna watch it because it's quite funny so on that note let's go ahead and jump into episode two of the brother's son a favor for a favor Not coming in the kitchen for food. Why didn't you tell me that your family's gangster as hell? Maybe you can vouch for me with your brother. I'm right as that. <laughs> Go put the suitcase in the car. Aye, aye, sir. Why the fuck are you saluting? He's a cook. He's a baker. Ch Child, uh, he took the whole thing. <laughs> God. <laughs> oh, he's such a baker. He's like, oh my God, the flavors, the texture, the crunch, the sweetness. <laughs> oh. Man, why are you sitting in here while there's a dead body in your kitchen? He understands what's being said too. He's just listening. Oh no, he doesn't understand. Never mind. <laughs> I saw you cut up a body. But who are you? I'm your mummy. If she knows about it, if she doesn't, you're just a liar. Mm. <laughs> you're delivering the package. That's it. Improv. Improv. Bruh, it's on wheels. Just roll the fucking thing. Hi, uh, my mom sent me. <laughs> of course. You <laughs> Yo, I can't stop. <laughs> I think I've been like this this entire episode so far. Wait. Uh, I don't know what he said. Yeah, I don't the trunk. That thing is a poisonous mouth sack. I don't want it. Men and their egos. All right, what have you seen on the security cameras? This club doesn't have any cameras. No, but next door is a pawn shop. Girl, what is this? I was trying to think of the last time we saw each other, and 
uh, you came home one day and grabbed mom's keys. Holding her hand and waiting in line and just like feeling like we were about to get away with something. Use a damn lie. My reputation helps prevent violence. Guess you forgot to pack your reputation on this trip. Nigga, go <laughs> with you. You may look like a child who gets bullied a lot. You're a swin. <laughs> Why don't you just take a picture instead of carrying around the whole head? Because then I would have a photo of some dead guy's head on my phone. <laughs> This is great. Just wait until the grand finale arrives. My kid loves dinosaurs. I got her a real dinosaur. Is it dead in the trunk? Galaxy Hotel, you impaled him with a pool cue? He's doing the Lord's work. Bulletproof glass. I can't hear you. The glass is too thick. Oh. There, there, there are people in dinosaur co dinosaur dinosaur costumes. The go. <laughs> Does improv. His security sucks. Mink him. Mink him. Mink him in the face. Mink. 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 Come on. In the kneecaps. What is happening? Yeah. Right in the wing ding. Mink his ass. Sir, do something. They got a thing in the car. Sir. Not with two knives. The way I can't. I have my test. It's 8%. <laughs> Oh, somebody's in trouble. <laughs> she will absolutely break you with passive aggressiveness. Go ahead. I don't care. Bet. Hey, mom. I'm never gonna break. What you're looking at here is an iron fortress of silence. Sir, I'm in my phone. Oh. And where are they? Baba Booey! If I'm not under arrest, I'm good. I just took the biggest nervous poo of my life. Yeah. Cool. I'm Grace. Why am I talking to you? Bitch, I don't know you. Nah! See? This is what I mean, Bruce. You gotta be thinking with your, with your big head, not your little head. Big head, you covered in dirt. Look at you. You fell through some shit. You was rolling on the ground. <gasps> Not the nigga. I'm like. This is Billy. I'm on the southeast corner of the alumni quad by the churro stand. I got a strange looking guy over here eating churros and he's covered in blood. I'm gonna approach. Why would you approach? Your security, not police. I swear to God. <laughs> Sweat your God. Charles. 
but you know him? We grew up together, and I paid. What do you have in the bag? That's a problem, but it's a good thing. It's kind of a problem. Nigga, open the fucking door! <laughs> this is the giant's name and address. You sure? I live here, dog. Bruh. Can I come in? Love to say hi to your mom. It's been like forever. No. She's uh, become a bit of a hoarder. It's a mess in there. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I approve. This message. Mm. Triad boss gets shot. Boss's son shows up in town and shit starts blowing up. That's kind of weird, right? My father's a businessman. Ma'am. Sir, ma'am. You should mind your business. Give me your phone. Girl, who? Nah, bitch. I'm gonna call myself from it so we have each other's numbers. Come on. Hell no! Girl, no! You are ADA or DDA. Fancy. We have so much to catch up about. Girl, I'm about to toss that phone like pow. Pick it pow. And I told you, I'm not a cop. Girl, I don't believe anything out of your mouth right now. He's fine. Yeah, he's fine. Right? Oh, that's what she called. <laughs> that's why she called him little fatty. <laughs> that is hilarious. Then you know parents don't be caring about nicknames. I'm sorry you had to see that. Have you seen that before? Oh yes. It was my job to lay niggas to sleep. I tuck them in politely. It was your tail. I stole Ma's car and we went to get fresh Yotel. Can I just tell you I freaking love him? Girl, I can't. Let me tell you why. I don't trust bitches. <laughs> I, um, I want to go see you perform. No! Girl, who is you? She's with the enemy. I don't care. That's enemies. You're in the middle of a murderous situation. Anybody approaching me, I don't know you. What you talking to me for? Oh, what you talking to me for? What are you talking to me for? You ain't never talked to me before. I've been Asian the entire time. Uh, what the fuck is that? Uh, is that what you face, this little sister? Who is that? What is that? Oh. Wait, cause then... They would have to be sisters. They have to be sisters. They have to be sisters. Here's the problem. The problem is, is that she's trying to keep him from this really, really badly. However, the people are automatically assuming he's a part of it. So you might as well go ahead and do the things you need to do to protect your son because your son's out here flailing and shit because he's not trained like your brother is. Your brother is definitely trained to handle some business. The young one is not. So I'm going to need you to put him in the know and have him protected at all times because, ma'am, things are about to get serious. Like, what are you going to do? What are you going to do about it? What are you going to do about it? You know what I'm saying? Oh, man. Who about about you? Listen, I love the show. I love how it's funny. I love how the, there's intrigue. I love how mom is like, I said what I said. I said what I said. I said what I said. I'm dying to know what's going on. Because it sounds like there's just somebody trying to take down everybody, but they could be trying to take down everybody uh, in order to consolidate under one and then 
be that person who's taking over stuff. But who knows? I mean, if they could be doing it for a good reason. It could be. I don't know. I don't know yet. Um, but I can't wait to find out. So on that note, guys, thanks for having me. Hopefully I'll catch you in the next one.